All right, in this video, I'm going to show you the landing page formula and you can use this to collect leads from your visitors, whether you're giving away a free digital gift, signing up people for your webinar, or even getting interest for your live events. The whole formula still applies. So let's start with this page from head to toe and I'm just using this as an example. Okay, now the most important thing and the one thing that stands out mainly is the headline now you notice this pre headline here the author was featured on now this is something you can optionally add if you have been featured on some of the local or international news websites then you can put the logos over here but i'll have you know that this is not important or i would say that it's not something that you must have in order to have a high converting landing page. But if you have it, then feel free to add it in. But I'll just have you know that it's not integral to your success, and that's the good news. The most important thing here is the headline. So as you can see here, it says here, free book, how to use the internet to make five figures per month income. Now, if you are in the internet marketing niche by any chance, you might have heard of School of Thoughts where you are told to be as specific with the numbers as possible like for example how to use the internet to make ten thousand three hundred twenty two dollars and eighty two cents per month now this might be applicable if you are using other traffic methods or you're using warm traffic but when you create landing pages like this you should factor in the possibility that you're using the likes of facebook ads to market yourself and I'll have you know that Facebook ads do not like you to put in hyped up numbers or things like that. So the safest ground that you have here is to be putting in things like five figures per month. And that's, that's okay. So another example would be perhaps a free webinar training, how to create a five figure per month income in four steps. Now that headline can pass. So now you know why I had worded the headline in such a way. So I advise you to check out the Facebook ads policy before you publish and advertise your landing page through Facebook ads. And that's a very important thing here because you're going to be using the likes of Facebook ads to continuously drive in evergreen traffic to your landing page. And this is the one you're making right now. The most important thing here is that you must draw a line between a headline that generates interest and get people committed rather than just curious to actually put in the name and email address which i'm going to get to that in a while and at the same time you can't over hype it and because facebook they don't like you to hype things up and with a very good reason because they are regulating the quality of the apps that they display to the users so you don't want to hype things up and blow things out of proportion especially in the main headline now if you look at the book cover like this that's okay from what i had discovered however the most important thing is the headline and more about a headline as well is that I find it that if you explain it in about two or three lines maximum, that works pretty fine and gets straight to the point because most of the pre-selling is already done in the Facebook ads post, which that's going to be covered in another video tutorial. Next up, you have, of course, the picture of your gift, if it's applicable, and most of the time it is. It could be a free ebook. Or if you're doing a automated webinar, then obviously you're gonna put a thumbnail of a video over here, or maybe a picture of yourself doing a presentation. That's totally fine. Now, the next really important thing though is that you're gonna come up with a list of benefits. So over here it's written, you're going to discover, followed by a list of five action points or five benefit points. Now, a lot of beginning internet marketers get this part wrong. The really important thing here is that you want to pick interest. Like, bear in mind, most of the time you're going to be expecting people who have never heard of you before this, also known as cold traffic. And you have to give them really good reasons why they should trust you right now, even to give their name and email address. And that's really important here. So, in the next four to five bullet points, you're going to list out a really good reason why they should join your mailing list right now 
and we know that of course you're going to be getting your free gift or join your webinar or in this case it could be a live event that's still all the same to you so what you do here is that in this four to five points you must address an immediate problem that your potential customer or visitor is having problems with right now and they're looking for a solution so the way i see it is that it's like they're in pain right now and you are um, giving them a solution and it's not just a bandage solution it's got to be something that solves the problem right here right now and yes we've heard a lot of marketers talk about giving value and while that is true if you think in terms of solving a serious problem right now you're going to be more than halfway there and your visitors will be more than inclined to part with the names and email address here so what you do here is that you get into all the finer details on what your uh, free offer can solve on the spot so as you can see here it's done in four little steps here and the final bullet point is always written as and many more or and much more to get uh, interest going okay so once you're done with that there's this button here called download now now this is the place where you can put in the opt-in box where you can ask for names and email address and it's totally fine to put in the opt-in form over here but on this page you might notice something's a little bit different here where someone has to click on a button and there you go this is where the opt-in box appears now this page was built with a page builder called optimize press and the function for this thing is called overlay optimizer so if you're using another page builder it might be called by another name but just know that in recent times this uh, pop-up box is a commonly utilized tool to ask for name and email address now if you're wondering why it takes an extra step for people to put in their names and email address and why not you just put in the open box here right away personally i had found out by putting this it actually increases conversions and opt-in rates and number two you have to also factor in that nowadays there are a lot of people viewing websites on mobile so this would be uh, quite an encouraging method it also saves some space it makes your site look a little bit better on mobile as well and if they're willing to be committed they'll click on the button and they'll put in the name and email address and finally really quick at the bottom here is that you're going to have the very essential pages like earnings disclaimer privacy policy and terms of use i'm not going to cover this in detail in this video but these are really essential pages uh, because when you advertise on the likes of facebook ads or google adwords obviously you are required to put in all these legal pages and you might notice here that there's this tax this site is not part of the facebook website or facebook inc additionally this site is not endorsed by facebook in any way facebook is a trademark of facebook inc now this is something that you can add to your landing page as well as a formality and that's really all there is to it creating a landing page is not difficult in fact it is quite simple the most important thing is that as long as you address the key concerns and how you can solve problems on the spot and you're willing to prove your worth then you can expect a lot of people to sign up with you right away and remember the purpose of having a landing page is to have people part with their names and email address so that you can build a list and you can follow up with them for as long as they stay on your email list so that's really the premise of having a landing page i'll be talking about how you can create your page step by step in detail in another video for more free educational content visit learnforfree.biz content produced and distributed by all superinfo